neighborhood. Neighbors along Eubank Street say they took shelter for hours as that suspect was aimlessly shooting out of that home behind me. Some taking shelter while others ordered to evacuate. I mean, it was a bunch of bullets, you know, blah, 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 blah. Neighbors shaken up. For my kids, it's scared for my kids. Confused at what was happening. I went out to take my dogs out in the backyard and I heard all this screaming. I seen the police officers here on Young and they were hollering and telling him to come out. One neighbor sharing this video with us as officers gather in her front yard, unaware of the standoff about to take place while she was at work. 22-year-old Kayvon Reagan prompted that standoff at this home in Northwest OKC when he refused to come out and surrender to officers, all the while threatening and shooting at them. But all the neighbors knew was to shelter in place. We were hiding in the kitchen, in my kitchen, in the, in the back, because officers don't come around this way. The fact that one of our officers uh, was, was injured in that incident, you know, made that even um, uh, more of a priority and because we know if they'll injure a police officer, there's no telling what they would do to the public as well. He's shooting and shooting. I think he shot the house. He shot the lit my neighbor's house. She come out of the police, took her out of the house and put her through the window and went into my house. The two sheltering in place as police worked to bring that suspect out of his home. They say the entire time. She was terrified I had to calm her down while well, I was scared too. That suspect was later shot and killed by an Oklahoma City officer. The people inside the home take out safely. Neighbors still reeling with emotions. I'm nervous. I'm still shaky. I'm shaky, you know, and I didn't think nothing like this would happen. And Oklahoma City Police Chief Wade Gorley says that officer who was shot, Sergeant Joshua Scott, is doing okay and expected to recover. Reporting in Oklahoma City, Megan Mosley, KOCO 5 News. Oh.